Don't they, General? Yeah, so never show myself on the camera. So, yeah, this is me mullet. Um, yeah. Um, so what we got here? Got the Ziggy 3. Um, got three gas rolls down there. Two are empty, one full. Use the, um, use the tongs. The Ziggy ones broke, so we use the Matador ones. So, uh, these are a bit dodgy. They fall apart when they drop. But they do a good job. Right? <coughs> Whenever we do videos, always jet fuel. No jet fuel, no barbecue, no videos. Without the jet fuel, we'll not do barbecues. I'll cook my own barbecues off the camera without the jet fuel. But every video contains jet fuel. Right? So. Got the tongs there. Now, I haven't got every barbecue thing in front of me, because I cannot be fucked in and out, because it's nearly five o'clock in the morning. But, that's me fucking spatula. Spatula's fucking great. You can slam burgers, slam steaks, just flip shit all around the fucking body. Fucking sick. Right. So, yeah, we've got the variation of uh, oils and spices down there. Always have me trust the oils, not Caltex, but always use me Australian Spanish oils. All right, they go fucking good. They got the old tank gauge. Now, this thing is absolutely caked in fucking oil. It needs a wash. Top lid is absolutely caked in dust, and it's got it's got battle scars because it's got a brick wall. So every time you hear me slam it, bang. She's up the paint. Now once once upon a time that was that was actually nice and shiny like Ellie. That's an aluminium lid. Uh, now it's got probably about uh, probably about a good half a millimeter caked in oil, burnt oil. So because everyone always says flame it up, so I'll flame it up. So that's what happens there. So what we've got here. We've got a pizza tray from the, um, the Pizza Hut cook-up. And <laughs> it's a garlic bread. Last garlic bread video. Oh, so I can see it down there. Then we the old trivet. So the trivet, I actually mainly bought the trivet for that. So what I'm generally going to do is I've got to take that middle plate out there to use that when I do pizza videos. Now, somewhere on this, it says pots and pans, trivet, and woks. Now, I am going to be doing a wok video sometime very soon. I mean, fanging to do one, I was waiting for the right idea. So, yeah, the old Ziggy. Yeah, well, I don't really want to take this off, because it is an absolute bloody mess. Now, it's, I always do clean it on the top, but underneath, it is a bloody mess. She is caked in so much shit. It would probably take me about a good two and a half, three hours to, to clean it right up good. But I always make sure I stay with the health standards. All right? So, yeah. You can take out this grill here, put a flat plate there, or leave a grill. You can either take out this grill here, or put the flat plate in, or you put the trivet in there. Or you can use a roasting dish. The roasting dish is bloody handy. And that side there, same as the other side, you can take the grill off and put a flat plate there. So if I really want, I can honestly just put full flat plates there, but I've only got the flat plate kit that does the middle and one side. Which, nah, I just can't be fucked on it. But, Depending on how this channel goes, I'm thinking I might buy an aftermarket full plat, full <laughs> flat plate where we can fully just smash burgers, burgers, eggs, bacon, you name it, we'll just smash it right up. So, yeah. So, yeah. I'm going to talk about indirect heat. Many people don't see it. I love, I love, my, I love my hair. Best hair. So, burner one. 
middle burner than burner 3. So when I talk about indirect heat, the indirect heat, what it means is you're actually using burner 1, cutting off burner or the middle burner, so really it's probably burner 2, then using burner 3. And if we have full direct heat, or just direct heat, then I'll use the middle burner. Very rarely, most cooks, I'll just use the full, I'll, I'll use the indirect heat on most cooks, sorry. But if I'm cooking snags or whatever, then I use all three burners, come down low. So yeah. Nah, she, she gets a good, she gets good flogging, from here, but um, she does well. So, got the temp gauge there, as I first showed. And uh, yeah, when I finally decide to take her outside and get that gurney on there, I'll, um, I'll show you guys a video. So yeah, that's uh, the Z3 rundown. And um, yeah, I hope you guys are all enjoying the channel and all the content I'm uploading lately. I'm trying my best to do what I can do. But any ideas, what you guys want to see cooked in there? Yeah, you know, if you want more roast rotisseries or more flame videos or <laughs> you want to see something different, fish or if I can get, I've got, I've got a wok, I'll put a wok on there. I'll put the, you know, get some curries or something like that going or some, try and do some kind of uh, rice and noodles or you know, we'll get some different shit going there. So just throw the ideas through the channel and we'll keep it fucking flowing. Cheers, guys. Fuck yeah. Peace.